Hey everybody, I'm here today with a quick math lesson on finding the missing angle of a triangle. Now this will be a very simple math lesson and I will be giving you two different examples. So let's get right to it. Before I give you the examples, um, one thing needs to be noted and that is that um, the sum of the inside angles is equal to 180 degrees. So the sum of all three of the inside angles of a triangle is equal to 180 degrees. So I'm going to start off by drawing a triangle and this will be the first example. So for this triangle right here um, we are going to imagine that this is 90 degrees, that th this angle right here is 90 degrees and that this angle right here is 35 degrees and that we don't know what this angle is and we are trying to find the missing angle and this is the missing angle. So um, in order to calculate the missing angle and determine the missing angle um, you need to add the two angles that you have you need to add them together. So we have 90 and 35 so I'm just going to do 90 plus 35 and that is equal to 125. So I know that the these two angles together equal 125 degrees. Now because all three of the angles are, are equal to 180 and these two angles are equal to 125, I just need to find the difference between these two angles and the complete set of 180 degrees. So to do that I need to take 180 degrees and I need to subtract this answer. I need to subtract the sum of the two angles. So I'm going to subtract 125 from 180 and um, that is going to give me 55 degrees. So the missing angle right here is 55 degrees. So I'll just write that up here, 55 degrees and I'll just put a little arrow. The missing angle is 55 degrees and I found that out by adding together the two angles that I had and subtracting that sum from 180. Now I'll do another example uh, right over here and I'll just show you, um, I'll show you how to do it one more time. So I'm just going to draw another triangle just like this and I'm going to label the angles and um, it's, there's not much space inside of the triangle so I'm going to label them outside but they are the interior angles. So for this triangle right here we'll just imagine that this angle right here is 110 degrees and that this angle over here is 20 degrees. So this angle is 20 degrees and we don't know what this angle is so we are going to have to find the missing angle and this is the missing angle. So once again I'm going to add together the two angles that we know which is 110 and 20 and that gives us 130 degrees and we just have to take this sum and subtract it from 180. So 180 degrees subtract 130 gives us 50 degrees and that is our answer. 50 degrees is the angle right here, the missing angle. So I'm just going to draw an arrow right there and I will write 50 degrees. And that's basically it. That is the process for finding the missing angle of a triangle. It is a really simple process and in this math lesson I have shown you how to do it as well as provided you with two different examples. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.